All right, here we go. So we want one of them. What a beautiful morning in the land they called Newport. My destination is that way. We are heading into town. Me and the farmer lamb, they're by there somewhere. They've walked on because I'm vlogging again. Um, I read online, sorry, it's a little bit windy. I read online, right, that there's a new vending machine in town. And I'm making a vlog to go check it out. Apparently, it's actually, do you know what? I'm not gonna tell you, you're gonna have to watch the vlog. So sit back and enjoy. Well, I said that, I said I'm not gonna tell you what it is. The title is all clearly gonna tell you what it is. So, a milk vending machine that does milkshakes, um, which is completely bizarre. It's like something straight out of Japan, which makes it really exciting. Because I've never, have you ever in your life seen a milk vending machine? Yeah. How cool you look. <laughs> What's he doing? Um, man, have you ever seen a milk vending machine before? No, not in Wales. Not in Wales? Where have you seen one? I don't know, like in Japan and stuff. Have you ever been to Japan? No, I've never been to Japan. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I think it's kind of exciting. Um, apparently they do milkshake. I, I, well, the, the article said they do strawberry milkshake. So I'm, I'm gonna go check it out to see if they do like regular milk or if they do like chocolate milk, how fresh it is. Obviously milk is something that you need to, you know, how long does milk normally last? Like a, a week, innit? But surely they can't leave it in there a week. Obviously it's refrigerated. I know it's refrigerated, but obviously they can't leave milk in there for a week. I don't know. Anyway, we're gonna go, we're gonna go check it out. So if you are new here, hello, my name's Mike. Welcome to Spud Boys TV. Um, if you want to just drop a subscribe to the channel, that would be spitting. Um, and if you're not new here, it's happening, guys. Um, I hope this vlog is going to be quite fun. It's only a small vlog. It's just something exciting and new. And I just want to go check it out. And I want to document it for the YouTube channel. Um, yeah. Newport. Man. How much do you like milk? I do like milk, but not. I like milk. So much, I actually made a song about it. Milk. Yummy milk. You make the sad feelings go away. Link in the description. <laughs> it has a naughty language. But I've got to be honest, guys, I can't believe how excited I am about a milk vending machine that does strawberry I don't know if it's just strawberry milkshake but it, surely they would do other milkshakes but the thing is uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna let you guys know now if it's too expensive I'm not gonna be buying it like a pint of milk you could pick up for what 98p probably less than that isn't it? 60p for a I pint of milk six pint is like one, uh, yeah, so you can pick up like a six for one pound eighty. So if there's anything over like two, three quid, I'm probably not going to purchase it. But I am going to go down and check it out and have a look. Okay, it is an amazing day today in Newport, guys, and that is the destination. Apparently, that's where the milk vending machine awaits us. <laughs> Doing a little bit of restoration. Look, Newport's getting quite a big uplift. It's a bubble any time. Just went into the market. If you haven't seen our vlog, check it out below. And now we're going to try some delicious, fresh, ice cold, nice cold milk. So this milkshake machine, that's what I'm calling it, the milkshake machine, <laughs> is situated by the toilets. Is that right? Yeah, if I think that's where it is, anyway. Yeah, it's in uh, the King's King's Way Arcade. It belongs to the Castle Dairy Shop. Castle Dairy Shop, yeah. I'll tell you what, I'll put a little clip in of me talking to the lady about it. You've got a, um, like a vending machine, haven't you? Yes, in the King's Way, and at the park. 
I'm gonna go vlog it. <laughs> Doing a little vlog on it. Oh, <laughs> Yeah, I will. A word on the street is that this place has a massive queue. So, um, again, everyone's really excited to go and try. Yeah, apparently the queue is massive, but we're gonna go jump in that queue right now. It's like going to Taco Bell for the first time all over again. Remember that, mate? When we went to Taco Bell? Oh, you weren't there, were you? He wasn't there, was he? Because someone doesn't like Taco Bell. Unless he was in school. So this here is the queue for it, I'm guessing. I don't think it is, man. Maybe they're just queuing to get out. No, they're, they're, que they're queuing for the milkshake. Right. I suppose we better jump in the queue then. We're just wondering the castle farm shop and then we've got the castle. It must be good there's a queue. So we're now in a queue waiting a for a vending machine milkshake. <laughs> Man. Milkshake. Milk. Mmm. This had better be the best vending machine milkshake I've ever had. Saying that it's the only vending machine milkshake I've ever had, so it's bound to be the best milkshake I've ever had. Non milkshake, vending machine milkshake. It's taking ages, I don't know what's going on. So I just found out though, in the queue that you have to come to this place and get your glass before you actually get your milkshake. So that's what we're doing, we're just gonna buy the glass. Don't know what I'm saying, it's two pounds, I think. But then I don't know if you need to pay for the milkshake itself. Don't know. All learning game, isn't it? Hi, my friend, how does it work with the milkshakes? Uh, so you, you can purchase the bottle here if you haven't yeah. got one. Yep. Um, with the milkshakes, there's a card reader only, so it's okay. a card machine. It's, it's straightforward enough. Uh, you, the next move, come back to bring your bottles back. You don't have to purchase a bottle, just go straight to the machine. Amazing. Um, how much are the bottles? Two pounds. I'll have a, a big one then, please. One. How much are the, the milkshakes? Uh, Two fifty. Okay, them. we're right. good. Fill my card if that's right, sir. Yeah, no worries. Oh, very nice. It's amazing, isn't it? Yeah, it's good. It's really popular. <laughs> got a I was, um, I'm, I'm doing a vlog on it. I was, I was over in the, uh, the, the, the new market just then. Oh yeah. And the lady was like, "Make sure you tag us in it." Oh right, yeah, yeah. So that's what I'm gonna do. Are you from Newport? Yeah, well, yeah, I live in Newport. Yeah. So we, we got a machine that on the farm as well, Bishton. Ah, okay. So, um, that's really busy as well. Yeah. But. I, you know, it might be quite in here, but I don't know. This is amazing. Look at the queue though, I bet it's awesome to see the, this. The milk is our own dairy here, so yeah. the milk, we, all, all we do is pasteurise it, so we just heat it up to get, kill any bacteria and whack it in. Oh, wicked. I'm excited. It's, it's, it's about 12 hours old now, don't you? That's awesome. awesome. Thank you very much, mate. Right, mate. It's my bottle. <laughs> That's pointless explaining what or how to do it and everything, because the guy has explained it all. I'm gonna keep this. <laughs> mm. A little bit of behind the scenes. <laughs> All right, here we go. So we want one of them. Typical, not accepted. Oh no, you have the card machine to work sometimes, you have to wait for it. Oh, okay. <laughs> I really, really wanted to try that milkshake. It looked really nice. It had 
it had a bunch of flavors. You could have had white chocolate, you could have had salted caramel, you can have chocolate, you can have strawberry, you can have vanilla. I think you can have plain old milk as well. It would have cost £2.50 to fill the whole thing up. Um, and then you don't have to re you don't have to keep on getting the bottle, basically. That's where the guy said. Um, it's like refillable, but obviously it costs you two fifty every time then. But um, yeah, because of that issue with my card, um, it, it just it didn't say it was declined. It just said um, it's not accepted. Um, no, and this is the same kind of thing which is happening in Morrison's. Every time I try to use my card in Morrison's, it does the same thing. So unfortunately, guys, I can finish this vlog with a happy ending, um, which is a bit sad because you know. I got really excited to to go down at all. Oh. Get on my seat. <laughs> this um, you know, pretty excited to go and try that. Here's a cool story for you. This chair here used to be the chair that I used to sit on on my dinners when I was in uni. I was in uni, by there, um, and this is where I used to come and chill out. I used to come sit here on my own. Sometimes I'd get oh. I had friends come and join me, and they'd talk to me. But most of the time I was on my own. I was a bit of a loner in, uh, in university. Um, so yeah, so unfortunately guys, there's loads of bird shit on this chair, and I don't think I want to lay on it. Lay? I don't want to lay down. I don't want to sit on it. Unfortunately guys, that was a, that was a fail. Um, as you can tell by the title, I was really, really looking forward to that. I could see everyone else getting their milkshakes. I was like, oh, I can't wait to try this. I was going to get chocolate, you know, so Logan can have some. But, um, yeah, I did it a few times, and the guy behind me was like, um, the little girl knew more. She said, oh, sometimes it takes a while or something. So, you know, I let it go, but it didn't work. It didn't work for me. Santa and tear. Um, I might have to ring you up and make a complaint. Because I didn't get my delicious milkshake. Now... On the way into Morrison's, I really fancy milkshakes, see? So on the way, I know Morrison's sell a milkshake called Moo. Um, it's a little bit different, I'm not going to vlog that. But um, that's what I'm going to do. On, on, when I go Morrison's, I'm going to get some chocolate Moo. And it's going to be delish. So yeah, so thank you very much for joining me on this little journey. I am sorry that I can't uh, taste the, the thing. Like I said, Castle Farm Foods, everything looked perfect. Their shop looked wicked. Their shop in the, in the market looked amazing. So it's not them, it's, it's my card, you know? So I'm not on a point of blame and saying, oh, you know, they're crap. Because, you know, the guy was really friendly. When I told him that it wasn't working, he was like, oh, I'm so sorry. And he gave me my money back. Um, he goes, I've never had that before, you know, not accepted. Um, yeah, so I don't, I don't know what's going on. But, um, but yeah, that is, that is the end of the vlog, guys. I, what's going on there? So I do hope you enjoyed the vlog. Um, if you're new here, I've already said like, but if you if you if you're not if you're unaware, my name is Mike. Um, the channel Spud Boys TV. Um, if you just want to drop a subscribe, that would be beautiful. Like this video, please, guys. That would also be very beautiful. It'll push the video out to more people and get people more interested in in me because you know I'm a, I'm a talkative guy. If you want to chat to me, just hit me up in the comments or you know if you want to email me and stuff. There's like just ask me for my email address and I'll and I'll, or I'll email you. And stuff. Stuff. Not a, not a problem at all. Um, if you have any suggestions on vlogs, you know, like I was on a boat earlier on, that there's going to be um, a food review revamp because we've got we've got a playlist with food reviews on it, but it's going to be a massive revamp of the food reviews. You know, we've got a cool little rating system planned, and, and um, it's good. I got a lot of schedule to how the vlog should go because when I went to Edinburgh, you know, I was just filming everything. I was just on the cuff and I don't think it should be doing it. I think there should be some sort of plan maybe you should have looked around and thought oh I'm going to vlog that I want to vlog that instead of just going somewhere but then saying that if we did do that I would never have gone into the um, the, the the cafe place on the mound I can't remember what it was called but it was uh, it was amazing it was like one of the best experience where we had the, the legendary name it was it was amazing so anyway thank you very much for watching the vlog guys um, I, I am sorry I can't get to taste the delicious chocolate milkshake but Shona did say there's another one in a castle maybe we should arrange not a castle in a farm so maybe we should arrange something we should go down to the farm that, that could be another vlog uh, in itself so yes thank you very much and I shall see you all in the next one mm -hmm.